So Anthony's caught me. He's mounting me. Maybe we're on the street. Maybe he's throwing punches at me. All right. I don't like that. He's throwing them outside, inside. Oh, man. I can't see him coming. It's dark, whatever. I can't block punches. How many can I possibly block? Here they come. You know, oh, man. Ah, it's just awful. Awful. All right. You don't want to get caught here. Now, here's a, a, a little uh, technique you can use on the street. He has clothes on. You never want to reach because we found out what happens when you reach up. All right? You get arm bar. I'm going to reach low. If he's got a belt, I'll use his belt. If he's got clothing, I'll, he can't arm bar me with my hands this low. All right? I'm not stretched out. I'm here. Now, he's, I see him raise up to do a punch. Good. I pop my hips up and pull. That's going to stop. Now, he might go back up. Try again. He's got to catch himself. All right? Now, what I want to do here is this. Rebecca. As I pull this, I know his hands are going to land right here. Here and here. I know this. I don't have to be a magician to, or a, a psychic to know where his hands are going to land. Watch. I pull him up. His hands are going to land right there. So I want to time it. As his hands are coming down, he has lost his balance. He's falling. I want to capture his arm, pull it in, and roll him. Preferably before his hand hits the ground. That's his most vulnerable time. So if, if, in slow motion, it would look like this. Hip pop, 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 pop. He's coming up. Pull it out. I'm turning my head. I'm bridging high. My nose is going to the mat. And I go over and up. That's slow motion. Again, I feel him ready to, I'm trying to block, block. Yeah, I feel him getting ready to throw a big punch. Here comes, there. Now I didn't get him before his hand hit the ground. So I'm gonna reach up, clasp my hands together, pull his elbow in, trap it, trap his knee on this, his foot on this side, bridge, turn my head, nose to the mat, Hip high, he's going over my shoulder and up, and that's called the upa. Go back again. I'm going to try to catch it this time as his hand's coming down. Here comes the punch, and up. And that's your defense from punching when you're not.